Okay, here is the clock, and right now it's just on the main screen, which you can see is showing the correct date. Now everything's working except for the out temperature and the shop temperature, but the date and the time is correct, and the inside temperature is correct. So... Yes, it's running a little bit hot in this room. And so right now you can see that the the lights in the Alaska are fading in and out in two to three different colors. And right now we're going to go through the menu here. So the way to get to the menu is just hold right here for a short second. And then it's going to go start wherever this dial is at. So we're going to start from the beginning. Here's time. And then we go over to date. And then next is sleep time. Screen brightness. Color changer. And then exit the menu. So we're going to start at set time. So here's how you set the time. You just tap. And then it's going to start blinking on the first number, which is the hours. You just move the wheel, or move the knob up to the time. And we're going to set it to 10. 33. And it is PM. And just tap again. And then it will start back up, and you can see that... Time is there. Now we'll go back into the menu. Just hold. Go back to here. And then if we want to set the date, go there. And then you just choose the month, day. Today is the 11th. Next, the year. And done. And then finally we have, well, hold here, go into, this is a cool little feature, the color changer. This allows you to do any color in the RGB spectrum. So for example, if we want to do an orange, we would just look, we can look for at Photoshop as a reference here. So we just take the values in the red, green, and blue, and then we just put them here. So red is 255, and then green is 120, close enough and blue is zero which should be pretty close to an orange color and it is and as you can see here when I change the colors that changes the color in the Alaska local so next and then it exits into the menu or exits the main menu now, finally, we have screen brightness. Just gotta wait till it goes through the menu here. And then screen brightness changes exactly what it says, just the screen brightness. So we can dim the screen all the way down to 70 or all the way up to 99. It's pretty bright at 99 though. So I'll leave it at 96. And back again. And that's it. There we have it.